The reason why this is important is because most people, they fail in direct sales because they don't know how to launch. They don't know how to launch their business. One thing you're gonna always find out about me, guys, is that whenever I tell you something, I validate it. And most of you guys, you have been losing in your career because you've been following leaders that you never validated what they tell you. Mm. You just follow them, oh, that's my guy. No, 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 hold on, man, I need to understand. Let me tell you why this is important. When a person understands why they should do something, that's right. It's easier for them to do it. That's it just good. can't be because I made all this money. Listen to me. No, no, no. These people are businessmen and women. A lot of them, you, they have to understand the inner workings of why it works. Here's the validation on how this system works. You ready? The very, the second company my wife and I ever got involved with, with the initial launch of our business in our first 30 days, we were able to do $65,580 in commission with this system. Mm -hmm. That's not volume. That's money that came into our bank account. The company after that we got involved in, it was a startup. Zero distributors. No distributors. We took it from zero to what it was built uh, to a few thousand people. And we were able to do almost 51000 in the first 30 days. Mm -hmm. The same system I'm about to share. So luck don't strike twice. <laughs> See, people don't understand the design. Now, I'm going to put this out here. I really shouldn't. I'm going to get in trouble for this. But I'm going to just yeah, say yeah. I didn't say it, we even if it's on the recording. <laughs> <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't do it. <laughs> Guys, right now, just looking at the income of, of I was, my partner, Damon Coleman, and we've been structuring some things and looking at it. And this guy's first 30 days would inspire. He's probably going to bring on running about a quarter of a million dollars. Because of the launch. Because of the strategy. This is, not a, this is not a game on how you do this. It's very, very simple, but there's a technique to how you launch your business. It's not about just make a list, call everybody. No, no, no. It's a little more than that. You ready? The first step is five quick steps. You gotta give it the launch strategy. Here's step number one. You ready? Ownership. And I'm gonna explain these to you all. I'm gonna explain. Ownership is very, very important. What do you mean, Damon? When you say ownership, I'm glad you asked. We're, we don't mean you own the company. You're no boss. What it means is you have to learn to take ownership of the momentum that the company has and utilize it for your business. Here's what I mean. Whenever we're having a conference call, you ready for this? It's always your call. I'm having a call That's good. with some of my partners from around the country. I was just giving you a call to give you the number so you can dial in. Well, what the call is all about, that's what the call is for. That's why I'm giving you the number so you can come here with it about. That's good. See, most people don't know how to utilize the company's momentum because here's what I want you to understand what happens to your prospects. When your prospects dial into that call, right? California. Indiana, New Orleans, Houston, Missouri. Oh my goodness, what's going on? What is it? What is it that Nora's involved in? All these people on, watch this, per call. Mm. So your prospect is always thinking the call is yours because you have taken ownership. Mm -hmm. I'm having a call with some of my partners from around the country. And you're tying your business to the momentum of the company. Watch this, guys. Let me show you how I use. I was using the Wednesday night calls. And I used it with one of my prospects out of California. I waited right to about maybe three minutes to the call because I could see the numbers. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I sent her a text message. Call starting now for you to get on. She dials in, Right? She don't know what she dialed in for. She don't know what she heard. She heard the numbers and all these people. Guess what she was texting me while the call is going on? Damon, I'm in. Can you just please put me in and make sure you take care of me? She had no idea what nothing was about. <laughs> See, the thing is, 
That's social proof for a lot of people. Mm. And validation, and you have to use this for your momentum. This is important. Whenever there's a meeting, you ready? It's always your meeting. It's always yours. I'm having a meeting tonight in Atlanta at the St. Lutheran Church. This is always mine. I'm always promoting <coughs> everything as mine. That event for the 5,000, that should be yours. I'm having an event in Atlanta with 5,000 of my partners that's coming. See, ownership. You own it. You own it. People are going to come for two reasons. One, many of them will come to support you. Two, some coming just to be nosy. <laughs> what you got going on that 5,000 people are going to be there? I need to come see. This is the way, guys. What, next two, two, Tuesday night I'll be in Lancaster, South Carolina. That's my meeting. Uh, Thursday night I'm going to be in Nashville. That's my meeting. Prospects that I have in these areas, I'm inviting them to my meeting. It's not an inspire. It's my meeting mm -hmm. that I'm having with some business owners in the area. Mm. I was calling to see. See, this is the way you always own it. This works in the launch technique. You ready for step two? <clears throat> launch as a group. You never ever separate your launch. Never under no circumstances. Let me show you what most people do. I'll never forget. I was talking to a good friend of mine out of California when we were launching the last company. And he was hearing about the success, so he gave me a call. He's like, dude, what are y'all doing, man? This thing is rocking. I, he said, how many calls a day you do? I said, well, how many calls are you doing a day? I'm doing nine as I'm launching my people. I said, nine? He said, how many are you doing? I said, one. Well, how do you do that? Because I put everybody together. Mm. I don't put anyone on the island by themselves. Right. Let me show you why this is important. Do you think your prospects will be excited to dial into a call that has 5,000 people versus 12? Yeah. That's good. Mm -hmm. Seven and the music playing because people ain't dialing yet. You're with doom. Hear a little tone every other minute. Doom. No, guys. Tie in to a company's momentum. Mm -hmm. Same thing with the events, the meeting. Everything is done as a group. That's why for the life of me, I want you to understand this. Guys, it, it amazes me how people, especially leaders, they don't open their events up to everybody. Mm -hmm. I've good. always been a person, I don't care if you go on my team or not. Right. That's right. Let me tell you why. Because I needed to use your crowd to help mine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> because guess what? My meeting probably would have had 10 people if you didn't go. Versus opening it up. Because guess what? Miss Nora Prospects that's here tonight, whoever they are, they don't have to tell me. I already know they're excited. But they're looking around this room, oh, it's happening. <laughs> so she was smart enough as a leader to open it up as a group. That's good, Demar. This is the way you build momentum. Mm -hmm. And many people, business, suffer because they don't understand these principles of launching. And everything is always separated and fragmented. You got to tie it all in. Anything you can ever do to unite with the entire market to get behind what you're doing, you should always do it. You want to see this everywhere. Look, guys, they got people looking through the blinds. <laughs> see, y'all ain't paying attention to that. They got people outside, people through the blinds. Peeping tongs outside. <laughs> You see what I'm saying? <laughs> this is this is this is principle. This is principles you have to learn. That's step three, you ready? This is important. Vision. I'm explaining to you. Let me tell you why some of you guys you lose and you struggle so much. You ready for this? Y'all always recruiting. Mm. Sometimes the best way to recruit a man or a woman is not to recruit them. Why y'all always in recruit mode? I mean, y'all just come across the salesman. Oh, what you want now? When they see your phone, what are you doing now? You don't want to be regarded as that. Yes. You guys got to learn to share the vision. Listen, the vision always encapsulates the opportunity. Yes. See, when you only talk opportunity, that's too small. Right. Don't ever forget this. Cost is an issue in the absence of value. The only time money becomes a problem, you never gave me a good enough reason to spend it. 
You got to wrap this. You got to wrap your mind around these principles. The reason why the vision is important. Let me show you something. I tested it out on y'all tonight. Y'all didn't even know. It. When I told you guys what Mr. Coleman is on pace to make his first 30 days. Guess what many of y'all were saying? Ooh, y'all should have saw your eyes. <laughs> it was the vision of that that was like, whoa. See, the thing is now, when you're talking to someone and you we're explaining to them, hey guys, you know, as, as inspires a company, we want to be a company that, that do a billion dollars in our first 12 months. Oh. A billion with a B. Yeah, currently my family and I, man, we want to take home a minimum of 10 to $25 million in commissions mm -hmm. over the first 12 months. Mm -hmm. I'm talking vision. Yes. So when I start talking to price, oh, the person like, oh man, put me in $500? Are you kidding me? A thousand bucks. <laughs> Let's do this. Because they get a chance to see where it's going. Mm -hmm. You got to do that. Stop always recruiting. Oh, I'm just telling you now. Oh, the chair pass, you got to hear it. Oh, wait till you talk to Mr. Crump. And wait till Mr. Coleman come in. You got to <laughs> Guys, listen. Those people don't care about what he's doing for anyone else. Mm -hmm. They want to know what is this thing going to do for me. Right. When you share the vision on where it is going, that automatically opens that person up That's to right. where now you have taken the recruiting handcuffs off. That's right. Vision, vision, vision. Anytime I'm talking to anyone, anytime we share it, once they've saw the video or anything, Mr. Brown, I'm talking vision. Mm -hmm. I don't focus on the opportunity. It's too small. Mm -hmm. It's too small. The vision can be as big as I make it. Listen, I want you to think about this. Many of you guys may have a job. Right? And let's say on your job you're making $40,000 a year. The young lady that's sitting next to you, if you're sitting down and you're talking to her, right, and you're sharing with her with me, you know, this opportunity I'm involved in, you know, right now, oof, my projections are I'm going to do, uh, you know, $100,000 in my first 12 months. That's your projections. Your projections can be whatever you want it to be. Mm. She's sitting next to you. Which, how can I make a hundred? <laughs> <laughs> you're not going to leave me out. See, you're sharing the vision. Let me show you how important vision is if you guys think I'm playing because I always told you anything I tell you, I'm going to validate it. If you go to a bank, ladies and gentlemen, right, and you go and apply for a loan for a business, what are they going to ask you for? Your proposal. And your proposal is what? Mm. Your vision for your projections. Mm. So what would the bank be buying into? Wow. That's the way you build your business. Individuals are going to buy into your vision, what you're projecting, what you're seeing. They got to know it's going somewhere, guys. They, they don't want to feel like I'm just another body you bringing in. You ready for this? Because you need the bonus. Mm. Or you got to hit a rank. People don't want to be used that way. Help me see. Well, there's a mutual benefit right. for me getting involved. Please, please, please share vision in your launch. You got to do this. Number four, you ready? 50. This number is important. Let me show you why. 50 is very important. Why, Demond? Do you guys know we already know that the average person, they can't put 50 people in a room. They, they probably can't put 50 people on a list to get exposed. We know this. Well, why would you have people doing this? Well, it's by design. We want you to stretch to get 50 people exposed for a reason. And I'm going to show you why, and it's tied to the compensation plan. Mm. Number one, out of your 50 people that you go after, we're only looking for 20%. That's it. Which is now this is for the average person. I'm not talking to the Derrick Browns and the Cliff Beats, and I'm talking about the guys and the Tracy Randall and Bobby Randall. I'm not talking to these type of leaders. They should be way past that. We're talking for the average person sitting in the room. I want you to hear this. 50 is your number because out of that 50, we're looking to get 20%, which is going to be how many people? Oh, y'all slow at that. Ten. <laughs> All these business owners in here, y'all can't count. Ten. Twenty percent of fifty is ten. When those ten individuals get started with demand, what are we going to do with these ten individuals? Ready? You're only going to get them exposed through the 
through the through the uh, uh, video, video. Mm -hmm. our opportunity calls. Do you guys know that our opportunity calls are going to be vision calls? Mm -hmm. They're not going to be opportunity calls like you're accustomed to. Right. We're not going to be on the phone selling it. Oh, oh, oh. And it, no, no, it's going to be a vision casting call. That's right. That the, the, the opportunity is all about. About the campaign and where we're going. That's what our calls are going to be about. When a person wants to know about the comp plan, we're probably going to refer them to the video, get the video from the person that invited you on the call. Mm. Because we're not going to sit on a call through a conference call trying to explain it to you because we're going to lose you. You're not going to understand it anyway. Right. Mm. Wow. <laughs> You're going to get lost. <laughs> See, guys, listen, this thing is thought out. We know the things that confuse people. So now with those 50, you got 10, right? Put a number one by those 10. This is for a reason. I got y'all doing this for a reason. Number one by those 10. You ready? What do you think we're going to have those 10 people do? Exact same thing. So now 10 times 50 is how much? Oh, my God. 500. 500. So now you have the potential of 500 more exposures. We only want how many? 20%. 20% to 500. 100. Let me help y'all out. 100. So now, you got 100 people in your group. Put a number two by the 100. What do you guys think we're going to do with this 100? Same thing. Same thing. Now how many exposures you have? 5,000. You don't have to mumble. 5,000. We only want 20%. 1,000. Put a number three by the 1,000. Now watch this. The matching bonus and Inspire's compensation plan goes how many levels deep? Mm, three. 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 You get a matching bonus on those 10. You get a matching bonus on those 100. And you get a matching bonus on those 1,000. It's paid out to you every single week. This can be done in your first 30 to 90 days. Right here, in terms of launching. That's all you're looking to do is always identify 10 individuals that you can work through to get 10 more from them. And you're growing exponentially. So that's why you're moving a little faster than the average person that's launching because <laughs> your launch is systemized. Mm. Very, very key, you know this. See, people think we get lucky on launches, but they don't understand we have a system we use. And that's why the success is happening so fast with so many people because it's an infrastructure that's put in place. Number five, you ready? Documentation. Do y'all know why so many people suffer in this industry? They're not documenting. People are always questioning you. The reason why most of the leaders that's in this room, they don't have any challenges, but they're documented. That's why they can pick up the phone and call and people listen. Because you have proven that it's been done. Listen to what I'm about to tell you. Don't worry about who's not, who's not coming with you. When a person rejects me, I get excited. No, let me tell you why. I'm being honest. Remember, I'm always bad at that. I'll give you a reason. The reason why I get excited, Dwayne, is this. The best way to build influence with someone is to do it without them. Wow. wow. That's my perfect opportunity to build influence with that person. That's why some of the networkers now that's calling, that knew about it from the beginning, that we talked to, and now with all these upset conversations, because guess what just happened, guys? Our influence has went through the roof. See, because the work that's been done and the results that we are gathering, you weren't involved. That's your chance to get your influence up with that person. So watch this. The next time I call you, you're going to pay attention. <laughs> you're going to take me serious now when I call you. So it's our job to get you documented. Let me explain something to you. A lot of companies have been born, doing a poor job at documenting their leaders. Yeah, if you want to believe so. Let me show you why. Most companies only document their leaders only towards network marketing. Businessforhome.org. In the network marketing circle. Hold on, guys. There's a whole big world out there. Right. 
No, no, no. We want to document you in a magazine that's uh, 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 displayed out in Alpharetta. Yeah. <laughs> we want to now help you begin to get a more diverse audience, right? Mm -hmm. Put you up on some billboards, the women of Inspire. Mm -hmm. Validating you. See, now the company is documenting you because now when someone is reading that magazine and they're hearing this young lady is leading the charge and helping women bring awareness around the country, come on, man. Who don't want to be associated with that type of individual? Yes. And it's giving you a diverse audience. So now you're getting outside of your circle and your box, but it's also the company to back you. See, it's our job to document you as fast as possible. One of the things I was a stickler for for this event, and, I, and guys, I, I was very stern at a meeting we had. And I shared with them, I said, listen to me, you all. Please hear me well what I'm about to say. This event has got to be about the people. The worst thing we could do is make it too much about the company and hear it from the corporate staff or me and DeMond Coleman, stop. It can't be about, they heard our big mouths enough. This event has to be about bringing people to the forefront mm -hmm. that we can begin to get behind as a company, mm -hmm. validating them, mm -hmm. documenting them, mm -hmm. so now they can proceed forward mm -hmm. and make it easier in their careers Excellent. in terms of individuals <laughs> that they're speaking to. Mm -hmm. Very important. Yes. That is the company's yes. job to do this for you all. I promise you that. See, we're not intimidated that a person can become bigger or larger. And most companies are intimidated about that, thinking somebody would take over the platform. Yeah. No, guys, you're doing the work. We want to get behind you. Right. That's men, too. Thank we want to celebrate you guys. Because here's what you all don't know. A lot of these backdoor meetings that take place with a lot of these leaders, I need you all to hear this. It's very, very short meetings. You know why? Because all that leader do does is pull up his back office. Mm-hmm. You in or you out? Mm -hmm. Because he's documented in the success that he or she is having for a person to see it's real and it works. Right. I'm just being honest with you all. I'm telling you what happens behind the scenes. And most of you guys, you struggle, especially with your launches, because you guys are not documented. It is our job to help you with that. And I promise you, we're going to be on a mission to do it. That's something that we're taking to heart to make sure it happens for your business. And these five simple principles is all you need to practice between you and your people in terms of launching. Listen to me, guys. Utilize every call to your benefit with your organization, the whole nine yards. Utilize it. Allow these calls to help build your business. Any event going on around the country, wherever we are, you know somebody, somebody in your organization knows someone. Plug them in. Right. Allow the system to do the work for you. You want the system to be the mentor, not you. Mm -hmm. I'm serious. I can't wait for the day where my phone don't ring anymore. <laughs> and people have all the answers because they have the system that they can utilize versus you always depending on an individual. Right. That's not the way you want to build your business. Important you know that. On that note, I want to take any questions, concerns, anything you guys may have.